cups of water, like this. There we go. Thawed Italian meatballs. Okay, get the meatballs in there. All right, we're gonna go ahead and grab some sauce. Get all covered. We'll have one more 14 ounce jar. Get it fully coated. Cover this. We're gonna go 425 degrees Fahrenheit. So it's been 17 and a half minutes. All oven times can vary. But we're gonna take it out. We're not done yet. All right. We're gonna take the foil off. Hoo, hoo, hoo. All right. But don't throw it away because we're gonna need that. We're gonna take it now. And we're going to get this all mixed around thoroughly, like so. Okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and return the foil back to the dish, and we're gonna go ahead and put this back in the oven for another, for the rest of the time, which is another 17 and a half minutes or so. Okay, so the time has came. It's been approximately 30, 35 minutes or so. All right, 17 and a half, 17 and a half, right? There it is. We're not done though, we're not done. We'll pull that off. Okay, look at that right there. All right, we're not done, but look at this. Almost all of that water is absorbed, but we need to stir this around again, like this. And then, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take two cups of mozzarella shredded cheese. We're gonna go ahead and cover this. All right, so now we need to go back and return this to the oven until all of the cheese is melted. So about five, 10 minutes or until the cheese is melted. The moment has finally came. Look at that, right? And then you can garnish this thing with whatever you want. We're gonna go with a little bit of Parmesan cheese for the top, chopped Italian parsley. And would you look at that right there? A dump and bake meatball casserole? Hmm. Right, here we go. Oh, wow. Look at the cheese and everything. Put that in a bowl, on a plate, whatever you prefer. And I guess the biggest thing is, everyone's gonna say, is the pasta done? Well, let's see for you. It's hot though, I don't know about the end. Here we go. Yes, wiggle, wiggle. Yes, mine are done. All right, now that we got that out of the way, let's try this all together with the meatball. Bon Appetit. Wow. Not only have you seen that that was easy, what did it take? What prep time? 35, 40 minutes? Hmm. This is really quick on a fast night. You ain't got to do nothing but put it in a dish. You all need to get out there and make this.